Hey everybody, it's Amy Graham, the Badass Valkyrie, and this is my lovely Hobonichi order. It came this morning about 10 o'clock. It is now after 5 p.m. and I have sat with this on my desk. I have fondled it, I have held it. I even put it in my Finding 52 focus video because I am very excited to get. So I am doing this on um, my little coffee table. So forgive me if it's not perfect. Um, I will try my best to keep everything in the uh, range that I need it to be. So two boxes. I don't know what's in what. So we're just going to take this one and open it up. I'm sure everybody has read this already. The yellow box. Not the first time they've <gasps> had yellow boxes. Okay, we're just gonna get everything out. Um, this is the Eric Tan A5 cover on cover. And wrapping paper. And uh, the free Fude pens for all the books, the free Hobonichi pens, which I freaking love. So yes, I will be using those. Put those to the side. Ah, I will go ahead and get all of this out and then we will take a look at it. So there, oops. Put it in the right way. Yes, I'm one of the weirdos that keep their boxes. Thank you very much. Put that off to the side. Put that little stack there. We'll open up this stack. Oh, oh. Let's see, more Eric Tan cover on covers. So there are three, I got all three sizes. Just stick those right there. Um, my camp. Another A6 cover on cover. Uh, ah, trying to get everything out. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay. All right. So, I'll put the other box. Thankfully, they're not crushed. Okay. Whoops. Didn't mean to knock you guys off there. I'm going to put those big ticket items right there. I will try to get these things kind of in some sort of order. And there's that. The only cover I got as far as uh, the regular covers. Okay, so besides the Eric Tan covers, I got an A6 cover on cover that was clear and a Weeks cover on cover that was clear. Um, and you will see why in a minute. I got the... A5, Eric Tan, uh, cover on cover. And I'm gonna take it out. I'm gonna show you the A5, just because it'll be the easiest to see. Because this is a little bit of a, of a um, cloudy cover or bag that it comes in but there's the cover on cover. So that fits the A5 cover on cover, or uh, regular covers. I did not get any A5 regular covers um, this year. I have the um, A A5 black with the orange on the inside that I got last year. And the... Um, I wanted to change out the cover on cover on it. And so that's why I picked that one up. This is the A6 version and this is the Weeks version. So I just wanted to have these because I really think the little guy is so cute. And especially on the Weeks because it has the little coffee cup and I love that. 
Eric. I think that is adorable. So I wanted to get all of them. This year, um, I realized that there were some cover on covers, um, namely the London, the Sweden, and the Japan or Tokyo cover on covers that I wished that I had gotten and I didn't. So I decided to go ahead and get those. This is the only uh, regular cover I got. And this is the camp cover. And I went back and forth. This was actually the last decision I made. And I wasn't going to get it. But then I changed a couple of things up and went ahead and got it. And I'm very glad I did. This has, let me make sure that didn't have those two little covers in there. This is a canvas cover, and um, see it kind of up close. Uh, you can also see the secret message on the inside there, hopefully. Hopefully the shadow doesn't block that out. But this is for the A6, and the cover is embroidered, and I loved that. And it just, I just fell in love with this cover. Uh, I love the little ukulele on the back, everything. I love camping and I love that it's got like a little Hobonichi on a stump, which is very, very cute. So, uh, and then the, the little tags at the end, one says, let's see, the dark brown says month and the light tan says day. But I love how they're like the little arrows that you would find on little camp ground signs. I think that's adorable. And I just fell in love with this cover. And so that's why I got the clear cover on cover because with this being canvassed, I, I could go ahead and scotch guard it, but I, I don't know how that is going to, to work on it. And I didn't want to risk damaging the fabric. And so I just decided to get the cover on cover. I, I don't mind covers on, cover on covers. And um, so I'm gonna go ahead and put this in. Now, um, the little pen clips fit on the outside of the cover on cover. And you just bend it back and put it in. And it just fits in there nicely so that it's protected. And then you have this back zipper pocket so you can access this back pocket and then it just closes like a Ziploc bag. Now, traditionally, I very rarely use that pocket for anything. So it, it very rarely gets used for me. Um, I'm going to, I got the, for the Hobonichi Techos, I got the uh, Hobonichi Techo English version and I got the Hobonichi Techo Original, but in the Avec. So this one has, I can open it. Two books, January through June, July through December. Oh, fresh book. Oh, I love it. And then this one is the English version. Now I wanna show you up close one quick comparison and we'll get on with opening up everything else. But uh, I know some of you have been wondering about this. Um, we'll just open that up. And I will open this up. Actually, let me see if I can get it to February 
4th. So here's the same day. This, again, is the original. This is the English version. So, if you see, look, here it has from 6 a.m., well, really from 4 a.m. all the way down to 4, 4 a.m. there. So it's got a full 24 hours for the timeline. You also have the five boxes up here. On the English version, you have just the, the 12 o'clock mark and a place for a meal. Nothing else is blocked out. But you also don't have those highlighted uh, five boxes right up there. So while you have the same size book, I find... Hello, Tear. How are you? <laughs> He's just like, what are you doing, Mama? So anyway, so this is the comparison. This is the same day in the English Planner versus the Hobonichi Techo. And this is the same way the uh, all-in-one book looks as well. So I just wanted to show you that there are differences in the English Planner versus the Japanese Planner that are more than just the quote at the bottom. So with the English Planner, the quote at the bottom is in English, obviously. And Tear is loving on this already. Hey, don't get your schmutz on my new books. And then here at the bottom, it has it in Japanese. <laughs> oh my gosh, little man. It's got it in Japanese. So also, you have the um, hidden line, hidden line there to, to kind of separate that. The hidden line is over here, two boxes in. So I just wanted to show you that there were some differences in the two planners. So there's that. And then I will show you really quickly how the English planner looks in this cover. And notice that I am bending this back because, oops, I just took that cover on cover off. Put that. But this is exactly how um, Hobonichi tells you to put this in your covers. You bend the cover back, you bend the cover on the, on the book back, you slide them in at the same time. It's not gonna hook, hurt the book binding. And there you go. And then you take one of the pens, which uh, for those of you wondering, it is a navy blue. It is not a black. Um, even though the grip does seem to be more dark than the um, pen itself, it's all navy blue. And then you have the um, 20th anniversary uh, icon there. So you take the pen, put it through the top hole, put it through the bottom hole. There you have the Hobonichi Techo. And this is the Camp Life cover, which I love. So there's that. This is the um, Weeks Mega, the Sneaker Weeks Mega, and it's in the blue. You get this open. And yes, all of these come with the, uh, the pamphlet. So I'm sure you've been, anybody that's watched any unboxing videos, I've already seen that. Um, oh, that's a piece of, of testing paper, which is awesome. Uh, the, the Sneaker Weeks also comes with these restickable um, page flags. They're like a, a bendable plastic. And I've used the, them wildly in my um, Sneaker Weeks. Now, this is the Sneaker Weeks. It's very bendy. 
and it is a mega. So it has got the full, um, let's see if I can, oh, these also come with the extra uh, little pocket in the back. You, I usually put mine like that, but you can put it like that. You can put it like that. You can put it over here. It's got a sticky back, so you can put it anywhere you want. These do not come with the Japanese uh, railway maps any longer. They stopped doing that last year, I believe. So in the Mega Weeks, you get 215 extra pages in the back. And it comes with an index right there in the front. And the start date for the weeks is November 30th in the monthly view and November 30th in the weekly view. The other weeks that I got whoops, is the camp weeks. Obviously, there was a theme that I fell in love with. And pull that out. Now, notice there was no paper for this one. Uh, it did not come with a testing page, but it does come with the extra sticky pocket. Let's we'll put that there. Now, I wanted to do a comparison as well. The Sneaker Weeks, while it is thicker, it is shorter. You can see that and not as wide as the regular weeks. That's why I use this one to deconstruct and put in my uh, Filofax uh, personal size molding. I take this cover off and I pull out the signatures and I deconstruct the entire thing. I will be doing that with this one and I will be filming it in the future so that you can see how to do that. This one is just the regular weeks. It's not as bendy. And this is the Thai fabric uh, cover, which I am not a particular fan of. They start and end on the same day, but this one only has 71 pages at the back for notes. So, um, but I this matches this cover. They were um, made in tandem. And the, the little secret is the little um, mushrooms under some of the trees. Some of the, most of the trees don't have the mushrooms, but some do. So I got one, two, three, four sets of mushrooms. So I love that. But I, I, I love to go camping and I usually spend a lot of my weekends during the summers camping with you know anywhere from 50 to 2,000 my closest friends. And I just felt like I really wanted this to, to go with my, um, go with as the theme together. And I really, really wanted this to match, um, to go with my weeks and so I'm very glad I got that. So those are the, the weeks that I got. And let me put that over here. And then this is the weekly supplement for the A6 Hobonichi. Um, in the Hobonichi A6 books, they do not come with a weekly section. And this is the separate book that comes with the weeks. And I got this because... Um, Various at various times, I have used this for various things, and what I'm actually going to use this one for is my. Um, I'm keeping a lunar journal, and so I'm I'm tracking the different cycles of the different moon phases, and so what I'm going to do is go through and note all of the different moon phases um, throughout the year, and then I'll keep that in with my lunar journal. And so I'm not sure uh, if I will be using uh, one of my A6s or I may be using Astology. I don't know, but I wanted to have this for that particular reason. So I will, once I get that set up, I will 
let you know more of that. So I'm going to put this over here with my weeks. Stick that in there. Okay. Now, I got all three sizes of this year's um, pencil boards, or Shitajiki. And uh, it said it was an almost orange. And if you I'll pull the week's one out... I get these every year. I just like having them. And uh, you can never have too many pencil boards. It is a red and yellow. And it is not really orange. This is more orange. The, the Weeks Mega um, little wrapper is more orange. But it's not a, a true red either. So I think it's kind of an... Uh, in between. And so y'all know orange is my favorite color. And this was as close as I've seen. So I decided to get all three uh, sizes to go. All right. So next up is the five-year Techo. And this is a five-year book. And I got it in the A6 size. And this comes with its own pamphlet. And obviously I cannot read that, but it also comes with a piece of test paper. So you could use pen tests and whatever you would like to do on that in the A6 size. And um, it has kind of a, it's almost like a PVC feel cover on this. And so, um, it ha if you can tell, it has a thick rim around it. And so traditionally, it does not fit in the A6 covers, the regular A6 covers. Like, it would not fit in this cover. And I will show you. Pull this Techo out. Um, this is the A6 size. As you can see, it is bigger than the traditional A6. <clears throat> and so trying to fit this into this cover, well, it does try to slip in there, but what happens is this is too thick of a book for it to fit into the traditional A6 cover. So you can see it is over the edge. So it does not fit into a traditional A6 cover like this. However, it does, well, let me finish showing you this. It starts on January 1st and you have, let me open it up, on every day of the week, you or every day of the, of the year, you have 2021, 20, 22, 23, 24, and 25. Uh, I'm actually glad I did not do 2020 because I don't think I would have kept up with it, but um, you have a slot for each of those years, and then you have a blank page on this side for every spread, every day. And so what I'm planning to do is, you know, write out whatever I want on each of these. And then over here, I will put in like the, um, the weather and just anything else that I feel like I, I want to include on this side. I'm still working on this as far as how I want to set it up. But, um, and I'll, I'll do an, uh, an in-depth of this at a, in a future video when I have everything all set up and ready to go. But uh, this is actually going to go in this A6 zip cover that I ordered. Oh, I'm so in love with this cover. Oh my goodness. This is the A A6 Ohio. Oh, Ayoto? The Ohio in Navy. 
Ohio. So it is a Mina Perhonen cover, and she's the one that has done the, um, the tambourine covers, which I'm in love with. But this is the zip cover. Uh, this one, the A6 is the navy. The A5 has the the same flowers, but it's a it's a tweed or like a a gray uh, twill to it. So, and this is a very textured fabric cover. I don't know if you can tell that from the from the the camera angle that I've got, but then it's got a gray inside. And let me grab these little plastic covers off of the ends. And it's got a green and a white um, bookmark. And you've got the square and the and the triangle. Those are typical bookmarks. Then you have the, the card, what is Mina Perhonen? And I don't read English. Oh, what is Mina Perhonen? So I will just hold that up so you can read that if you would like to do that. And then the Hobonichi card that comes with each one. So I always keep these. Um, and then on this cover, you have uh, a pocket there, a pocket that you have to just kind of get in from that side. There's no zipper or anything. Whoop. You have a pocket there and you have a pocket here. You also have a pocket there, 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 here, which goes all the way to the bottom. Then you have a little tiny pocket there and another little tiny pocket there. And in the back, this one opens up, so you have a big back pocket to that as well. Now, I am very excited for this cover because in theory, the A5 Techo fits. And that fits perfectly in the zip cover. Now, it would not fit in the regular cover, but it does fit in the zip cover. So that lets you know that there is some extra room in the zip covers. And I have it caught on, whoops, on the bookmark there. There we go. So, I this is the cover that I wanted to use with the A5 or with the A6 um, five-year techo. And I'm just going to put those like that. We'll just tuck those up in there. No problems whatsoever fitting it into that cover. And that is just an absolutely gorgeous cover. I also have the Mina Perhonen um, orange, uh, neon orange tambourine that I can switch it out to if I want. And then um, I am still looking for the woven tambourine from 2017 and um, in the A6. I have the A5, but I don't have the A6. And so that's the one I'm still looking for. But I love this cover. It is gorgeous. And these are all embroidered. So I just think those are gorgeous. They're off-white in a very light pink. So I wish this kind of grouping was on the front, but that's okay. This is all varied. So no two covers are really alike, um, but the A6 uh, five-year techo fits in there perfectly. So yay! So that is my haul for 20, what is this, 2021? <laughs> I'm like, what year is it again? And uh, I have... Um, I already have my my uh, cousin Avec, which I bought from someone from a friend who got an extra one and didn't realize that she had ordered two. So I do have that as well. So this is most. I mean, this is my complete Hobonichi order. Um, it is not my full on 2021 planners, but it is my Hobonichi planners. So I am very excited for them. And I will be putting all of these in a big family picture soon, but I am loving the covers that I got. And 
I think they will uh, be in good company and I am looking forward to using them. I do have the A6 um, from last year and this is the orange one that has the, um, the orange insides. And then this is the, uh, the Shitajiki from 2020. So it was the blue. It actually matches that blue really well. And I have all three sizes of this as well. But um, I um, will probably be putting the a Eric Tan A6 on this um, and doing some things with that. But yeah, that is my Hobonichi order. And uh, it's kind of all over the place, but I'm excited for it. And I love everything that I got. And whew, I am looking forward to setting everything up. So there you have it. If you have any questions, um, feel free to, you know, ask me down below. I've, I've ordered Hobonichi for the past four years. I love them. I've used every size that they have. And um, almost every book. The only book that I had not used was the um, five-year techo and now I have that and I will be setting that up with uh, everything that I will be doing for next year. So I am very excited. I, I have never had a five-year book before and I was going back and forth trying to figure out if I wanted the A6 or the A5. I'm glad I went with the A6, um, and I'm very excited. So hopefully this has been um, a good comparison for a couple of these things. And again, if you have any questions, please feel free to ask below, and I will try to answer them as best I can. But uh, this is my 2021 Hobonichi order, and I'm very excited. All right, you guys, have a great day. And as always, spend the rest of your life celebrating because it is worth every moment, and I will talk to you soon.